So one of the most important aspects with my project that I needed to get working was to be able to communicate between Arduino and processing. Now to do this, what I had to do was to first open up a new Arduino sketch and then within the void setup uh, enter the serial.begin9600 bode rate and then within the void loop section uh, just add a print line and then as a test in this put the hello world classic uh, string in speech marks and then just add a delay of 100 milliseconds so that it doesn't uh, bring the data in too fast. Now if I go to, if I upload this to my Arduino and then open up the serial monitor you can see here that it's just bringing up hello world across the top there and it's just streaming down endlessly now if I just close that and now switch to the processing bit now what you have to do in processing is since this is sending it to the serial port in processing you then have to access the exact same serial port and so first importing the serial library you then have to define the serial port and give it a name and then a variable is created which is just a string which is the same as that from Arduino then in the setup you define the string and the port name and then this is the bit that's most important you have to know which port your computer is using for Arduino so that the exact same port can be entered into processing now in mine it's two but this will be different for each machine then my port equals new serial and then this is just it accessing that port then uh, so you've got the same bode rate that's equally important you need to make sure that that matches up with what you've put in Arduino and then within the void draw function you first are searching for an available port and to see if there's any data there uh, so they're checking my port which is what you called it earlier and then for the variable that we created called val uh, what you then do is you're reading the string that's being sent to the port from Arduino and this little bit here is just for as long as it keeps on going so it will keep reading the string as long as it's being entered and sent from Arduino and then here, just below you've got print line so it, what it's doing there is it's just going to print out all the data that's being received from Arduino in the serial monitor at the bottom here in this black space so if I now run this sketch and I'll just extend it a little you can see here that hello world is now coming in in processing so it's being sent from Arduino and successfully received in processing so what I now plan to try and get to do is to use some light sensors in Arduino get those values then read those values in processing and play movies based on those values